How you going team? I have had a horrible day and when things are going wrong as they have been all day what do you do man? You go fishing or you go hunting. It's my, it's my fix for everything. I'm gonna put this over here. It's backwards but it doesn't bloody matter. There's a bit of sun out still and we're a bit bald on top. Just everything got broken and oh, my humour hasn't been very good. So I thought well stuff it. Put the boat on the back I haven't eaten still, and that's probably why I'm grumpy. I've had two coffees, been working my ass off, and every job just seems to fail. The computer crashed, I lost stuff on my SD card, bloody dogs are misbehaving. I smashed my knee into the bloody, or my shin, not my knee, into the drawbar on the back of the Land Cruiser, this Land Cruiser here, and that fucking hurt. So uh, I figured it can't get any worse, so we'll go fishing. And I am hungry, so I threw some bits and pieces into a bag. Probably, it'll probably carry on being a shit day and I'll probably catch nothing, but you gotta try, don't you? And I bought one of these sheep off the farmer too. That was a while ago. Charged me too much, 200 bucks, way too much for cash for a sheep. But uh, by the time I drive into the, the sales where they sell them and pick it up, drive back, it's 40 bucks of fuel and road user and all the rest of it, so oh well. So I took it, so if I don't get any fish today, I was going to fatten it over two weeks, but I'm just going to come home and butcher it, just to make myself feel like I've achieved something, because it'll be one of those days where I haven't achieved anything. And uh, I don't know about you, but if things are going wrong, I find that the best thing to do is to change the pattern. Even though you don't feel like doing it, you don't really feel like motivating yourself, but I always do, and as soon as I get out in that water, I'll be feeling a whole lot better. And it's the same with hunting. Well, I can't talk anymore because the road's just there and if I talk and hold a camera, I'm breaking the law. And I wouldn't do that. The road's just there. Well, I was hoping for some bird action on the water, but nothing's happening. A couple of oyster catches. They've got men in black raincoats just hanging out in the shallows. Hey, check out this, uh, I won't say sunset, but just the rays. I don't know if it's going to come out on camera, but... It looks amazing, it's like heaven. That is wicked. Just zoom in a bit for you. But that just looks really like, I don't know if it gets captured or not, there's just rays of light coming through the cloud. Let's go on a bit further there, that's wicked man. Still no birds working the water. Oh, we're gonna go out. Oh, Pace, you're already in the boat. Hey, you jump up there by yourself, mate. Good boy. You do that by yourself now, eh? You know the drill. Good dog. She starts every time. Well, this is a bit better than sitting at home, get pissed off or things not working out. It's pretty hard to be a grumpy old man when you're out here. And it's beautiful. Oh, the wind has dropped. There's no bird action. Well, there's heaps of birds around here, so they're, they're here for something. They're all along on the coast here. I'm gonna drag a lure just along and see what happens. I'm using, I'm going to put that in now, Let's see how we go. Well, would you look at that, eh? Hey, what's that pace? <laughs> oh, just nerves, it's dead, folks. But that is dinner for me. Looks like we'll be eating fish by the light of the moon there, Pace. Gonna take a run and make the fire. How easy is that? Good boy, eh? 
Well, that's uh, dinner. I made this out of an old gas bottle. I could have painted it and stopped it going rusty, but I don't really care about that. Got some dry stuff inside. Going to crank it up. I've burnt off the pipe because it's it's made of galve, and galve's bad for you. So I gave it two and a half hours just roaring, just to burn any of the fumes off that might be poisonous. And I'm going to crank it and draw my fish on there. I like these long matches because they get to all those places. Once that dry wood starts to burn, the pine cones cop it. Should be away. Maybe I should let that there you go so it can come out the top a bit. It's putting out some heat. Hell yeah. Now yeah, she's going good. Every time I catch fish it attracts this woman behind me here. You can only see a light. It's Awi. Hello. Mm, haven't seen you for a while. So we're going to share my fish and cook it on my homemade fire. And it's looking good isn't it Awi? Yeah it's really good. It's really good eh? It's working really it's well. Look at cute. that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> A lot of people dissed it when I made it, you know, different things, uh, it's too smoky and all that, but it's going to cook fish. I haven't cooked a fish on it yet, this will be the first time. Oh yeah. It'll be fine. Mm. Absolutely perfect. It's not even smoking and it's really got a nice heat. Sea salt with seaweed. It's really nice. Smell. I'm so hungry. Best meal of the day. And that's a nice heat, not too hot. Just nice. I was worried that I couldn't control the heat of this cooker, but it's easy to control, you just put less wood in. I don't have the cleanest hands after dealing with that fire. I'm going to make a salad, which is not for you, Pace. Salad, I like. Yeah. Have my dressing. Some avocado oil, which is really nice for a salad dressing. And I think our fish is just about ready, are we? Yep. I'll turn it over one more time. I think we can just about have that. I've only got one plate because uh, I wasn't sure if you're coming down. I'm going to take this off so the fire comes out to keep us warm. And I'm going to put some more pine cones in and get that going. There it goes. <laughs> the chopsticks I gave you aren't that flash. That tastes good though, with the avocado and the lemon. You actually get more fish this way than you do filleting it, I reckon. Mm. Thanks for watching guys, get out and do something exciting yourself sometime and just make it happen. You don't need a lot of money, just need a bit of imagination. Make something out of a, an old gas bottle and cook your own kai up that you catch yourself. Be good, can't be good, be careful. See you later. Before I set off today fishing I wasn't in a very happy mood. And my mood is completely different now. And I think I said when I was driving down the driveway that uh, if things are going crap, change the pattern, and you change how you feel, I feel totally different today. Absolutely different. Got the ukulele.
gonna play some music. If you're feeling down, get on the phone. Listen to Pacey's crunching the bones. He feels all right here in the night. Hey baby, everything's all right. Sweet as bro, sweet as bro. Everywhere we go is sweet as bro. Singing sweet as bro, sweet as bro. Everything's gonna be sweet as bro. Pace, get out of the shot of the camera. We're trying to make a YouTube video here, mate. And you got your face right in it every time. There's a whole beach here. And where do you have to go? Right in front of the bloody camera. Hey? Where you go, Pace? Where you go? He enjoyed that fish, didn't he? There's not even a scale left. Everything's been eaten. We didn't waste one bit. Well, that's my vidi video. See you again soon for another show. Get out of the shot, you're right in it. Couldn't give a bollocks. That's it, singing sweet as bro, sweet as bro. Everywhere we go is sweet as bro, singing sweet as bro, sweet as bro. Everything's gonna be sweet as bro. Everything's gonna be sweet as bro. Everything's gonna be sweet as bro. Hey oh, hey oh, on a beautiful spring night in the top of the south in New Zealand. Everything feels alright. Spring night. 